Uganda. 30 Ugandans tricked into serving as mercenaries in Myanmar. The Ugandan government is holding talks with the government of Myanmar to try to rescue 30 Ugandans forcefully recruited to serve as mercenaries in rebel-controlled areas. Since the military coup in Myanmar on February 1, 2021, over 30 insurgencies have been operating in the Southeast Asian nation. The 30 Ugandan mercenaries were duped into traveling to Thailand and Malaysia for non-existent IT jobs before being diverted by human traffickers to rebel-held areas in Myanmar. The total number of Ugandans believed to be held captive in Myanmar and working as forced laborers in rebel-held areas is around 450. According to the UG standard, several Ugandans went on social media in December to express the horrible conditions they were working in while being held captive in the Asian countries they were taken to by recruiting agencies. Tens of thousands of people from around the world are believed to be held captive in rebel-held areas in Myanmar. As reported by The Observer, Ugandan Prime Minister Robina Nabanja stated that the Ugandan government has contacted the International Organization for Migration, which promises to try to get the government of Myanmar to help rescue the Ugandan human trafficking victims, as it has with others previously. Meanwhile, about 60 Ugandans overstaying their visit in Egypt must acquire an Egyptian sponsor and pay a $986 administrative fee to receive a resident permit. Those unable to obtain a resident permit will be jailed or fined between $15,570 and $32,698. Similarly, the Ugandan High Commission in New Delhi, India, has reported that around 200 Ugandan women mostly victims of human trafficking, want to return home but cannot afford a plane ticket. The victims were tricked into going to India for non-existent jobs. The Ugandan government is currently deliberating on how to finance the repatriation of its citizens who are victims of human trafficking in Myanmar, Egypt, and India.